impact is what they count in the spirit realm. So what impact are you making while you live? Stop counting your head. Start counting your impact. Welcome. This is Apostolic Charge Broadcast with Apostle Lawrence Bamilo. Stay charged to be in charge. There are two ways to answer the prayer. One, the supernatural and the natural. Just after your encounter, there should be a corresponding hard work. Remember sometimes you are in a program with some people and they got answered prayer and it felt like, why didn't God answer me? God might have truly answered all of you, but they went ahead to corroborate the prayer with hard work. Get ready in this broadcast for a charge to make faster progress. Welcome to Apostolic Charge Broadcast on Agent Television. This is Apostle Lawrence Bamilo. Establish this very well. This is our year of unstoppable progression. God told us this year in Apostolic Grace Network Africa that we will make progress and nothing can stop us. But I got to understand that the only person that can stop you is you. And if you will not allow ignorance to stop you, then you must know my people perish because of ignorance, lack of knowledge. So open your Bible to 1 King 18, 46. Okay? The power of the Lord came on Elijah. I'm reading NIV. And talking his cloak into his belt. Mark that word. <laughs> Tuck in his clothes. That's the meaning. In the olden days, the major clothes they wear was those gown, and then they would tie a gado with such a cloth. Nobody can ever gain speed. Elijah know with this cloth I am putting on, no way I can make a faster progress. The hand of God has come upon Elijah and it was never for fun. The hand of God was a propeller to give him speed that he could catch up with chariots of Ahab. But Elijah knew there is a reality here. Elijah knew this is a division of labor. God has done his part. I must do my path. His hand is already upon me. He has, there is a prophecy of the year already in your local assembly. There is a declaration over your life. You have been hearing prophecy. You have fasted at the beginning of the year. But there is still a part you must do. Elijah know that nobody can run fast with this kind of cloth I'm wearing. This cloth I put on myself, this gown, this jalamia, I can't gain speed. So what should I do? Elijah packed the cloth and tuck it in inside the gadu, the belt, and tie it so his leg could move very fast. So what Elijah did in clear words, Elijah took care of what could stop him. If Elijah depended only on the anointing, if Elijah depend only on the prophecy, if Elijah had depended only on the declaration of the man of God, if Elijah depend only on the promises in the Bible, in the scripture, he will still be quoting that scripture years upon years and remain on the spot. In fact, situation of life would have pushed him away. So Elijah took care of what could stop him. What is it that could stop your faster progress? God has told me to tell you, and you believe in this anointing, that you will make faster progress this month. However, before you will see progress, you must follow process. What are these process? Take care of anything that can stop you. Talk in your pride and go and learn. Talk in this your pride. Humble yourself and put a cut through this man. This your progress you have been praying on mountain for could just be a phone call away. But pride will not let you call that destiny helper. Because you have called about three times and they couldn't pick, that made you feel like hey, if they didn't help me, God will send another help. If this is the person God wants to walk through, God will not send any help anywhere. Talking your pride, humble yourself and seek for help. I put it to you right now. If you will talk in your ignorance, I am taking it one after the other. 
talk in your ignorance now. Take care of your ignorance and seek knowledge so you can make faster progress. Nobody ever make progress beyond the level of their knowledge. You can't go beyond your knowledge. It is as far as your exposure can carry you. Talk in your ignorance. Take care of your ignorance. Take care of it now now go for knowledge go and learn new thing humble yourself go and enroll in that fashion center go and enroll in that hand work center and learn talk in your ignorance you will make faster progress there is no doubt god wants to use you there is no doubt that god is promising you he will give you nation talk in your spiritual pride and submit under a higher anointing there must be a spiritual father over you there must be a covering there must be somebody speaking and praying for you. There must be somebody carrying you on their shoulder. Nobody ever succeed on their own. Talk in your pride and get a mentor. Get a coach. Submit yourself somewhere. Anything that can stop you, anything that can hinder your speed, take care of them. God has told us this year we are unstoppable. So as Elijah talking his clothes, he took care of that cloth. Take care of any emotional issue around you. Never permit anybody's tears to stop you. You see, I tell you, Frank, don't let anybody's emotional tears, sentiment, don't let it stop you. This year, never let anything stand on your way. Take care of it. Any staff, anybody that is not complying in this your organization, if you want and won, and this person is standing on your way to making progress, excuse that person, fire the person. This year, never let anybody build unproductive empire around you. We have been here all this while. We have the one that even started this organization. Anybody that is not going your way, cut them off. Anybody that is not seeing what God is showing you, take care of your spirit this year. Take care of your relationship with God. Take care of the way you receive instruction from the Lord. That is the only way you can make a faster progress. If you leave that clothes like that, if you leave that situation, if you leave your spiritual life anyhow, if you don't take care of it the way Elijah took care of it, you will stop yourself. And I don't want you to stop yourself. So I bring a chart to you today. Let's start with that before I make one simple declaration. First, do you want to take care of your spiritual life? You know that your fire has gone down. You have, if you know you have even fallen into sin or you want to give your life to Jesus, you regret being a sinner. Put your right hand on your chest right now. Repeat after me. Say, dear Lord Jesus, I run to you as a sinful sinner. I am sincere right now because I need your mercy. Please forgive me, dear Lord. I want you to help me this year. Please help me take care of this addiction. I will follow your path. I will serve and do your will. Thank you because you have answered me. In Jesus' name I've prayed. Amen. I pray that the mercy of the Lord will reach you wherever you are right now. I prophesy by the mantle of the apostolic grace, any arrangement of the hell to stop you this year. They are destroyed in the name of Jesus. I ask you to go and the road is cleared. You will make progress. As you follow these instructions, you will make faster progress this month. It is done in Jesus' name. Who you follow in life determine what follows you. I would like you to follow me on all the social media network at Apostle Bamilo and subscribe to our YouTube channel right now so you can see more messages that will set you on fire. AGN Television. Subscribe now. Pick your phone and do that. And we would like to hear your testimony and how this broadcast has been a huge blessing to your life. And I am sincerely praying for all the partners of the Apostolic Grace Network all over the world. My God will bless you abundantly. As we take the gospel to dying souls around the world, your harvest shall be mighty here on earth and also in eternity. YouTube can be one of them. Make use of the information on your screen. I will see you in the next broadcast. Till then, take care of anything that may stop you and go ahead and make faster progress. You are unstoppable. God bless you. Thank you for being part of this broadcast. This broadcast was brought to you by the continuous giving of friends and partners of Apostolic Grace Network Africa. 
to join the AGN Air Force, please visit apostoliccracenetwork.org or call 234-708-222-0300. Until next time, God bless you.